We are back now on a Saturday morning, and this is a day of mixed emotions for us as we celebrate the last Saturday today with our dear friend, Kristen Welker. As you've likely heard, Kristen is soon going to be leaving us to take on the role as moderator of Beat the Press. And we couldn't be more proud, but we also couldn't let her go without taking a look back at some of our most memorable moments here on Saturday Today. This is Today with Peter Alexander. Kristen Welker. I could not be more thrilled to welcome Kristen Welker, her first official day as co-anchor of Saturday Today. If it felt any better, I think I'd be floating around. Every day, I just think, this doesn't feel like work. This is what I've always wanted to do. I was an intern for the Today Show. Good morning. I'm Kristen Welker with a look at today's headlines. If you look at that footage from when I was an intern to right now, it's unbelievable. I'm so thrilled to be Jump here. Up. We got a great crowd. You know, we do this every Saturday. Yeah. Yeah. Can we do this every Saturday? I Welcome to today and welcome to today and welcome to today and breaking news overnight. Let's get right to today's news. There's a lot of it. Big story this morning, the coronavirus pandemic, protests overnight in the wake of the death of George Floyd. Politics now, the race is on. President Trump and Vice President Biden are making multiple campaign stops. Really heartbreaking images come out of Ukraine. Just 10 days to go until the midterm elections. Wildfires continue to burn in Canada. <laughs> And I welcome you to the final 2020 presidential debate. What specifically are you going to do to make China pay? So far, I respect very much the way you're handling this. Praise from the president and viewers alike for Kristen's master class performance as moderator. You are awesome. We can't wait to see how well you do in 2024. <laughs> Kristen Wolf. Don't you need to recalibrate to some extent to try to work across the aisle? I'm in this career as a journalist, which I'm so proud of, but my great passion is really starting a family. After years and years of trying, I'm having a baby girl with John, and it's with the help of a surrogate. Mom, are you ready to become a grandmother? I am absolutely ready. <laughs> yeah. Every minute with Margot is just pure joy. I sat in a support group with couples who are struggling with infertility. What gives you hope? What keeps you going? I don't believe that hope goes away. I won't. How did you not let that get you down? Do you know whose idea it was to bring the cherry blossoms here? What's the lesson? What do you learn here? Mm, we don't want to do war. Yeah, never. Like. Ever. sharks every day. But in the briefing room, this is different. If I get scared, I might clutch onto Peter. I thought I was still afraid, but it's actually quite peaceful down here. With it's clear. It's a little windy out here. Look at Kristen Welker breaking up some ninja moves. <laughs> Who are we talking to? Hi, friends. How we doing? My no! 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 What's up, Peloton? My name is Kenny Reesby. You're a boo. <laughs> Gosh, look at this. Let's hey, do class to being together. Cheers. We all have mullet mania. I did a really quick dye job. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You're not going to find that on me. The <laughs> You okay? <laughs> oh my God, I can barely speak. We speak so oh, often. You, guys, you, you and I talk about so often we're focused on the future, the next thing in this business, the career that you began back in Reading in the old days. But I think I would just say how much you have taught me and we together have enjoyed the moment. And the moments yes. we have shared for the last three years, I will cherish as some of the best you ever get. Sometimes you don't realize how good you have it till it's gone. I'm just grateful that we've been able to enjoy this time so much. And as we celebrate this time, there's some others to help us celebrate. Yeah. It as well. If I can no. bring these guys in, you may know oh them my as Margo Lane oh my God. and Johnny Hughes. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, Say hi, Margo. mommy. Hi, sweetie. Hi, so oh, I got lipstick on her. Let me give you my <laughs> <laughs> Margo. Oh, this is a lot John. of attention. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Oh, hi, Margo. Hi, sweet pea. Oh, I'm speechless. You okay? You've left me completely speechless. Um, oh, but I have to say something. Um, I want to say to our viewers, thank you all for joining us every Saturday for uh, the 
news show that we are so proud of to the entire weekend today team, which is the A team, the most amazing team in the world, um, led by Matt Carluccio and Dave Shire. Uh, I am so grateful for all of you for making this a family. We have been a family every single Saturday. To my actual family, John and Margo, nice the loves of my life. Hi, Margo. <laughs> to Angie and Joe for coming up every weekend to DC. Okay. Yeah, you're okay, sweet pea. So well. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? Um, I want to thank you guys <laughs> and um, to Peter. I just want to say Peter and I sat together a long, long time ago. I'm sorry, I got lipstick on you, sweet pea. And we said to each other, what would it be like if we could anchor a show together? And um, it was just a dream that we talked about all the time. And um, Peter, to get to anchor this show with you, to get to do something you love with your best friend, someone who has become like a brother to me, has just been the greatest joy of all time. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Doesn't get better than when your teammate is your best friend. Yes. We love you love so you. much. Love you, love you. And congrats to Laura Jarrett. You're going to love her too. We're back <laughs> after this. Margo, you look, you were awesome. You look great. You look great. I love you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.